YouTube, so I'm back for a video. I haven't been on YouTube in so long. I'm so sorry, like I kind of like vanished like out of nowhere. Um, I always seem to do this, but I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know you, I owe you guys an explanation, but I'm hoping that um, that will be in a different video and not this one because this one is actually a Christmas haul and it's from different stores from Target, the 99 cent only from Dollar Tree. Yeah. And then I'll explain if I have any other ones. And I'll also tell you the prices. Now, it's not going to be in like specific order just because I have put them all together. And uh, they're just going to be random. So I'm going to first start off with uh, this mug that I picked up for my daughter. And it's this reindeer. I think it's a reindeer. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> so I picked up this reindeer mug for my daughter. I did pick one up last year for her. I think it was the snowman one. But this was $3 and it wasn't in their mug section um, or their kitchen stuff. It was actually on like uh, end caps kind of. Well, not really end caps. They're like the Christmas, you know, cardboard things that are out in Target and... Um, it was three dollars, which I'm not too sure how much they were last year. I think they were three dollars I I don't even remember but I picked this one up for her because I wanted a different one um, For her and I really like like the care uh, not the characters, but I like more of the ones with like I don't know like Santa Claus on them or the little truck stuff like that So I picked this one up for her then I picked up another one. This one is from the 99 cent only and it's this one that comes in a ten, uh in a box and these are the 10 ounce box mugs and it's the santa claus one or the belt like the belly of santa claus so this is what this one looks like and yeah this is like the only one i really liked and wasn't i don't know um, maybe it's the only one that I saw that I really liked. I've seen some at Dollar Tree, but I didn't really like their styles because this part of most of them is like kind of yellowish and I don't know, but this one was actually white. So I picked this one up from the 99 cent only store. Then I picked up these and these are light up necklaces. They're Christmas ones. I actually picked up three, but I took one out of the box. Now, we are planning to go to Disneyland the beginning of December for my birthday. So, I wanted these for the light up parade. And I thought they would be neat because I have seen them in other places or different stores for like $3 or $2.99. Which I think is kind of ridiculous because Dollar Tree sells them. But this is the open one. And you do have to take out the little tab before you, you know, put it on. And... Now the lights do change in different ways. You can see that. So I thought these would be neat for us to have on during the light parade. Um, so yeah, I bought three of those for me, my daughter, and my husband. And then from Dollar Tree, I picked up these which are glittery. Ugh, they're so glittery. Now my Christmas theme is traditional Christmas like the green the red um, the very vibrant colors that's the way I like it and I like it because I don't know it just stands out and because my daughter's so little um, I like it I don't know I like those colors but I am going to be decorating just a little for my bedroom can I speak? I'm going to be decorating for my bedroom, which my bedroom is like the charcoal gray and the blush pink and silver and black and white. <laughs> so um, I want to decorate um, a Christmas tree and they're not a big one, just a little one, um, like the, you know, tabletop ones. And I picked up these and these are in uh, the silver glitter. So th there is like fallout, but... I just think these are so pretty and they're like kind of like a really statement piece for a small Christmas tree. So I picked up three of them. There's the second one and there's like glitter falling everywhere. And then this one. So I picked up those three from Dollar Tree. Then I picked up 
this from Walmart and it's a Christmas ornament and like I said I like the traditional so um, my Christmas tree has a lot of Santa Claus and I like the you know the bright colors so I picked him up from Walmart he was a dollar ninety four and I should have picked up a couple more but I only picked up one I think I'm gonna pick up a couple more of these I just think these are cute I don't know but I think these are breakable which I'm not a fan of because my daughter but that's fine I mean she is five going on six so she should know by now that she doesn't need to be breaking these but I just think he's so cute because he's so chubby and um yeah I just really like him so I might pick up a couple more then I picked up these from Dollar Tree and these are just plain like nothing exciting it's just a red oven mitt so I picked up that one then I picked up the pot holders they come in two and then I picked up the pot holder um, but it has like the backing on it so it has like this on it um, and then it has the pocket in here so I thought I would make a gift for my daughter's teacher and um, yeah do like an iron on um, vinyl on here so I will be doing that and putting like a cookie mix and then um, like a like a cookie I don't know whatever it's called I don't know what it's called like a stirring thing um so I thought that would be a cute gift you know say something like a teacher quote or something like that or Merry Christmas in really pretty font so yeah I did that or I got that um then I picked up these from the 99 cent store and once I got these then I kind of regret it I wish I would have picked up maybe two more I picked up these placemats and they're just in this really bright red like beautiful red they look so like good quality and I did fold them that was my fault but they didn't come folded <laughs> but um, they're just so pretty and I can't believe I found these at the 99 cent store now they didn't have very many but I picked up four of them um, and yeah I think I'm gonna go back and get a couple more that's bad huh but they're only a dollar which isn't bad because I paid four dollars for four place settings and the quality quality seems really really good so picked up four of those then I picked up this this was actually from Fayaz I don't know it's a store here in Arizona and I think it's another states but I'm not sure but th this was the first time I've ever went into that store and um I saw this blanket and I loved it so this isn't for our couch but it's for our couch for our dog so it's not for us it's for our dog but I just love the colors this is what it looks like it's by the brand North Point um it's 50 by 60 inches and this is just a really pretty Christmas. She needed, our dog needed a Christmas blanket because she has a Halloween blanket and I haven't gotten her a fall one, which maybe if I find some like on clearance or something after fall, then I'll pick some up for her. But she likes to lay on our couch pillows and um, yeah, she's so annoying because she sheds. And I mean, I love her to death, but she sheds and I have to put a blanket over our pillows then she lays on top of those so I thought I'd pick her a Christmas one and I just love the color of this blanket this was $5.99 if I didn't say but yeah it's from a star a store called Fayaz here in Arizona which um, I was quite I didn't know what to expect going in there okay but they have some pretty good stuff I'll be honest. <laughs> so I went to the Target Dollar Spot. I think the rest of this stuff is from Target Dollar Spot. Um, I'm going to start off with these because these are the color of my bedroom. And they're these stockings. These were $3 each. So I picked up this white one. It's like a faux feather. One. I mean faux feather. Faux fur one. Um, so I picked up this white one. It does have like the little... 
I don't know, little balls at the end. Um, I thought it was cute for my room because it's the color of my room. Then I picked up the gray one. They do have the gray one. Again, $3. And then I picked up this one. Actually, my daughter picked this one up. She's always grabbing stuff. And then I finally, you know, she was playing with it. And then I finally kind of gave in. And, you know, it is the color of my room. So um, I picked up the sequence, like, pink. It's kind of like a blush pink. Well, a pink. I don't know how to describe this pink. But that's kind of a blush pink. And this is the color of my room. So I could do it this way or this way. But that's just blinding. But um, yeah, I picked up these three. And I thought these would be cute since I am going to be decorating my room this year. And I'm so excited. I've never decorated my room for Christmas. So I think I'm going to do it before Thanksgiving. Because the rest of the house isn't going to be decorated until after Thanksgiving because my family, um, we might be doing Thanksgiving here at my house like last year. And um, they're like, no, wait until Christmas after Thanksgiving. Don't put up your Christmas stuff. It's not Thanksgiving yet. So I'll do it the day after Thanksgiving on Black Friday. <laughs> so yeah, um, this is the stocking so nothing too exciting about those actually they are exciting because they're gonna go in my room um then i picked up this sign i know you guys have seen all this stuff already but i wanted to show you what i will be incorporating into my house um this is the christmas the fresh cut pine um christmas tree sign and I really like this. This is very farmhouse. And you know farmhouse is in. And that's like my kitchen. Like completely my kitchen. I'm trying to make it more. But I'm very minimal um, farmhouse. And I love the farmhouse feel of it all. Like I just love it. So I picked up this one. And I thought I could put this in. I'm not sure if I would do it in the kitchen. But I might. Uh, maybe around my coffee area, which I'll be doing my coffee bar again. I did it last year. If you didn't watch it, I'll link it down below. But I did my coffee bar area last year, and that was a lot of fun. So I'll be doing it this year again. Um, so yeah, pick that one up. That one was, it was $3. Then I picked up this sign, and this one is a sign. It's not a sign. It's a Christmas... Um, what is it felt envelope oh my gosh so this was a dollar these are always a dollar but I thought this would be cute for my Christmas tree I'm so into Santa Claus on my Christmas tree and since the Christmas tree is kind of big I like to incorporate big stuff like this onto my Christmas tree so this one just says special delivery to Santa Claus North Pole and yeah so maybe I can add my daughter's name somewhere on here with um, iron on vinyl. So yeah, that was a dollar. Then I picked up this. This is a 25 count sticker countdown. And it just has it all the way to 25. And this was a dollar. It has it like on like a box up here. If you can see right there. So, yeah, it's just in different colors, and I thought it was really pretty. Then I bought these three. These are little mini stockings, and these were a dollar each, and I love these. Oh, my gosh, I love the color. I love the vibrant red. Um, I love how you can – I'm. what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put these on my Christmas tree. I'm going to put our names on here. I'll probably put like my daughter's name, uh, my husband's name, and then my name. And then just hang these from the tree somewhere. Um, if I put them somewhere else, then I'll probably show you guys. But yeah, these are so cute. They're little bags. I don't know. They're just so adorable for a dollar. Oh, gosh. Sorry. I dropped the bag. Okay. Then I picked up these. These are hanging chalk signs, and they come in a pack of two for $3. Let me open them. Sorry if that was like, yeah. So they look like this, and I just think they're so cute. 
Um, you can always take this off and put a different, you know, ribbon on the back. Um, I love these. I love how these could be farmhouse. Um, these you can use for Christmas. You can use these for Thanksgiving. You know, you can just hide the sign and put this in front of the food. Um, you can use this for a lot of things. So I'll be repurposing these. I don't know if I'll use them for Christmas, but yeah, these are super cute. Then I picked up this set, which they're bigger. Does it say the size? No, it doesn't. Um, but these are bigger and these are actual tabletop chalk signs. So they come in a pack of two for $3, which I think is a better deal. And I picked up two of them and this is what they look like. So there's two and they're kind of like, you know, stand up picture frames, which these are neat for basically anything. You can write, you can use these for a wedding. You can use these for Thanksgiving, a birthday, Christmas. Did I say Thanksgiving already? But you can really use these for New Year's. Um, yeah, you there's all kinds of options you can use these but i love these little things oh i love them i'm gonna pick up more i don't care i like to have these in case we need them for like parties or stuff like that then i picked up just a couple more things i picked up these uh mini jingle bells sorry my nose is itchy um these mini jingle bells and these are 16 count and they're just in red. They were a dollar. I don't know what I'm going to use these for yet. I, I'm thinking a wreath, but that's the only thing that comes to mind. If you guys have any ideas, please let me know. Then I picked up this. This says it's a wood ornament. It was a dollar. And it's just a Christmas tree in wood. And I wonder if it stands up by itself. Oh yeah, it does stand up by itself because it's kind of thick. It has gold like foil all around, but I want to do like a vinyl, um, you know, a vinyl saying maybe with our last name or the year or something like that on these. I think it would be really cute. That was a dollar. Then I picked up this one and this one has the Santa Claus sleigh and or the reindeer sleigh. Yeah, reindeer sleigh. Um, this was a dollar and it says it's a gift topper, but I'm gonna use this for an ornament. You don't have to use these as a gift topper. I'm gonna use it as an ornament for my tree. And it just says believe somewhere right there, if you can read it. Um, so I will be putting that on my tree. Then I picked up one more thing, actually two more things. I picked up these gift tags. It's an eight count and it comes with the snowman and then Santa Claus and it's four of each. And I just thought they were really cute. I wanna go to the Dollar Tree and get more, but I'm gonna wait um, to get them. Then from Dollar Tree, I did pick up this and this is a paper coasters. Uh, they're pop fit, it says pop fizz clink, I think on it, yeah. So these, this is what the packaging looks like. And I thought these would be cute for like New Year's. So that's what they look like. Don't mind my nails. I had been staining like a week ago and yeah, my nails are really bad. <laughs> um, gloves don't work. So I picked up these, thought they would cute, be cute for like a get together with girls or not that I have them very often or at all, but um, I just thought it would be a good idea to pick these up to have on hand. So I just want to share a couple things with you guys because I know um, we're like Target fiends and we all love the Target dollar spot, but if you guys have the Target truck from last year, um, which I will show you guys this one right here this little red truck that was very popular last year I picked up two actually um, I will be having I have an Etsy store where I do tumblers and I will be adding this vinyl um, Which I put fresh cut on here because I'm a big Ray Dunn fan and I know a lot of you guys are and I I know a lot of you guys are um, into the Ray Dunn, but I had did this vinyl on here that says fresh cut and on the back 
has it says pine trees so i will be having it on in my etsy and i'll link my etsy down below um so i i do mugs i do tumblers it's my side business that i started uh will be going on um like a year i think in february well actually in february so you know not that i started doing my shop in on etsy and yeah i just have some things on there if you guys want to check it out if you guys don't i completely understand but i know that we all have this um little red truck and i did this specifically to fit on here and it says fresh cut and then on the back it says pine trees and then for mine i actually put my last name on there um just because but um i think it's too you could put your last name on here but i don't think i'm gonna sell it like that just because it's too thin i don't want it to be too risky for you guys to um for it to rip or anything like that but mine did i put that on there but i think it looks really cute with the fresh cut and then the um the pine trees on the back then i, I do want to show you guys um i have a couple tumblers i have a christmas tumbler that i actually just did these are the ones I'm telling you guys about that I have on my Etsy shop, um, which the link will be down below. Also, I have my Instagram um, and Facebook as well. But um, these are like the type that I sell on my Etsy. But um, they're the 16 ounce tumblers and they're the skinny tumblers. And this one just says ga gangster wrapper. But I have a whole bunch right here. Um, I'll show you guys a couple of them. I also do like custom ones for people, you know, that ask me, but I had some Halloween ones. I have some sports ones. I know I got, I get a lot, like I have this one, like this girl loves her Dallas Cowboys. Um, I have, I have these I did for a customer and these were the Halloween ones and they are the Mickey and it says uh, the names on the bottom with the purple lid. These are the sports bottles. So yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and share that with you guys. If you guys want to check out my Etsy, it'll be down below. But that is all I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I need to go pick up my daughter. Um, I'll be doing a video just explaining why I was gone and all that. So I hope you guys stay tuned and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.